I've been called an abstract painter. I use a lot of color in my work. I can say that it derives from a certain type of looking at specific moments in art history. Uh, definitely I was looking at you know, modernism, American modernism, European modernism, but also looking at uh, African art and uh, structures in African art, borrowing from them to create a type of language that would locate that space, but still deal with issues that are pertinent in the West and Western art. I was thinking uh, quite a lot about seasonal things. I mean, I was thinking about Iowa and the times that I visited it. My parents were here uh, in the 60s as students, and my mother always tells the story about stepping on ice for the first time and sliding down the street. When I had my maquette for the painting, I was feeling uh, quite a lot this, this surrounding sense of atmospheric, natural, in the way that we might think of landscapes in America this kind of naturalistic space. Even if the colors are not derived from nature, I'm dealing with and creating something that I felt was something that had this great atmosphere to it. And that's why the title Surrounding is really, uh, I think, very appropriate for the work, Surrounding. So I was just thinking a little bit about that, the colors of this space, the surroundings. These lights that they have in this lobby are really actually very beautiful. They add a certain different coloration glow. They bring the green out of the wood as they sit there like, you know, drops, you know, honey drops. They got this kind of golden, warm, almost orange color flavor to them, you know. And they um, are quite distinct in the space. And then I was thinking quite a lot about the Pollock painting, the mural that you have here. And uh, looking at that for its color and for its structure, I wanted to think about how I use my drawing and color to make a space where you have maybe clear, directed parts that come together to make a complicated space, a complex space. So there's that inspiration with the work. My colors are not necessarily close to the Pollock painting, but I'm thinking a lot about how uh, drawing and color can join together to make something really new and unexpected. But I like the way so far in which it has this, um, again, this atmosphere to it that you can enter the work rather than the work pushing out and pushing into the people that are here in front of it, but that it might be absorptive and allow people to feel as if they can walk into the space.